Come have fun with us and don't forget to subscribe. What's up everybody, I'm Rick. And I'm Anna. And welcome to our reaction to Naruto Shippuden episode 419. Welcome. Anna, mm. your first time watching Naruto. Yes. And of course, Naruto is one of the anime on our list of 101 anime we want to watch in our lifetime. On this channel, we are covering those animes. So many animes. So many. And so many episodes of Naruto. Last time we watched one in mm. which uh, Guy... Yeah, we started the flashback mm -hmm. of Guy and his uh, life story. Yes, uh, with his dad. Who... He had a dad, who knew? Yes, oh my god, <laughs> the shock on my face, you couldn't imagine. Um, but yes, uh, his dad, who was mm, similar to him in many aspects, uh, I guess that's that's how it often is. Yeah. Um, but also, apart from the flashback, we had the revelation you've been wanting to know. Who's the smoky shadow? The smoky shadow, the smoky right. the bear. We found out. So it was. Uh, Kabuto. Kabuto. Who also seems to have had a change of heart, which makes sense because that was the whole point of the... That's the only way to get out of that jutsu. Yeah. 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 And he got out. Mm -hmm. He learned something. And now he's helping? Question mark? Um, I mean, it seems like he's saving Sasuke or helping Sasuke. Mm. Um, I'm not sure what his intentions are beyond that. But, uh, you know, in a situation like this, in a war like this, hey, as long as you want to help me, I'll, I'll take, take it. it. <laughs> yeah. I'll take it. Well, you know what? We will take we'll take this episode, uh, which promises to be interesting. Mm. And if you guys want to take early reaction from oh, us, you can also do reactions. that Where? by subscribing to and our becoming members. YouTube. Yes, uh, as a early member above, you could be watching this video early. Uh, so if you're interested in that, check that out. Mm. Oh, that's nice. And he's always talking about uh, youth, you know. Oh, yeah, he's like... You're just five. Of course you wouldn't, like most kids wouldn't be able to win against, you know, someone like an adult. Kakashi did it. Yeah, but I mean... Oh. Is this the lesson that we're gonna get now? It's not about defeating Madara. It's about protecting, you know, the others. These two cry a lot. <laughs> <laughs> they do. <laughs> That's their style. Yeah. It's touching. Certain someone noticed guy though. Mm -hmm. There you go. Yeah. Even though we didn't run the the five hundred laps. Yeah. We pulled them for what? <laughs> Report them for this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Show off. Yeah. Oh, look at him, he's shivering. Poor kid. It's just the clothes. Yeah. It's kind of creepy. It is. How did he do that? <laughs> I'm sure that's a talent. <laughs> oh, they're making fun of his outfit. His outfit is very important to him. We know that. It's always so extreme, you know? Yeah. Why not start with a number that you feel... You, like you most, most likely won't be able to achieve it. Mm -hmm. 
But that's the point, because then when you don't do it, you you go to the next thing. And you do the next thing. That's funny, because like he say they're laughing at him because he couldn't do it, but I bet they, they couldn't, couldn't do, do yeah. like half as much as he did, you know? Because mm -hmm. they were laughing at him in the previous episode for only doing like 200 and something laps when he said he would do 500. Could they do five, uh, 200 laps? Like, Could I they do 100? Could they do, yeah, exactly. I'd be dead after one lap. That's pretty hardcore, just punching a tree. Uh, yeah, a tree, tree trunk. Yeah. Kakashi's just there. Oh, he's intimidated by Kakashi. <laughs> oh, look, his dad is watching him. Stop eating the kid! <laughs> it's still those same two ladies there. Uh... Yeah. Watching. Oh, you didn't care anymore. <laughs> hey. Oh, he really doesn't want to have to hit challenge Kakashi. Getting better. Yeah. Yeah. You need 500 laps around the school. Yeah, he really doesn't want to have to fight Kakashi. <laughs> that he'd rather do the, yeah. these things. Does he? It feels like looking at him. I like would it's think hard, it's yeah. so hard. <laughs> look at him, he's barely breathing. But look at this. Like as she stopped. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He's not just passing by anymore. Acknowledgement. <laughs> what is he thinking? What a crazy guy. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder why he's doing so many push ups. Look at that, huh? One hand. Mm. He was already doing that as a kid. And it, it looks like... You know, when you see him passing through the village like that chill just with his book, it looks like... He's not working he's, hard, he's just good. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. Well, really, no. Which is why, you know, like, they talk about a lot of characters as, like, geniuses. Mm. I always found it a bit annoying because it diminishes their hard work, their hard work right? Yeah. They called Neji a genius and we saw how much Neji worked, yeah. right? They called Sasuke a genius. We saw how much Sasuke worked. And just to yeah. be able to, like, get close to his brother. Right. You know? Yeah. And even then, that wasn't enough, right? Right. Like... It's interesting because it feels like they call a genius someone who just has, from the beginning, a spark, mm -hmm. you know, like a talent, but that that's like not nearly enough. Yeah, and you have to hone it. Yeah, exactly. And I feel like for the people from the outside looking at, at someone like that, they would think like, oh, he doesn't need to do much, you know, he's already great. Like, no, he just, he's like naturally good at something. But that doesn't mean that that's enough. Like, even if he has a talent for it, he still needs to train it and to work on it in order to use that, whatever, you know, his talent is. Yeah, but even from that point of view, you know, what does that mean to have a talent for it, right? Yeah. Like, is it just that, oh, this kid that uh, isn't the first time he entered the academy, uh, he was better than all the other kids, so we assume he's a genius? What tells you that while the other kids were playing, this kid at four years old was not already... Training. You know, training. Yeah, right. Like, you don't know why he was better mm -hmm. than them at such an early yeah. age. 
yeah. it doesn't just pop out of nowhere right like, like maybe um neji too you know he was so good in his clan because he trained from a, an early a very early age hmm. yeah it's interesting it reminds me a bit of hinata she kept I watching naruto looking, yeah it's another way to frame it, right? When yeah. I do it, then I'll challenge him, rather than yeah. if I don't do it. His best half. Look at him, he's barely holding on. That's crazy though, that's crazy stamina to just do... Yeah, to run so much. Mm -hmm. He did it! <laughs> so, this, <laughs> this is you! <laughs> <laughs> this is funny. And so was born a series of challenge. Yeah. Dang. Don't break the village. So intense. Yeah. <laughs> These women are still watching this. I guess they've I been supporting they've been, you. Yeah, they've been watching you this whole time. Yeah. Oh, he's just doing a... Genin... Small time missions. Jobs, yeah. While guy is already out there. Mm、what is going on? Hey, this なんと、勘弁してください。どんな任務でも彼は大丈夫に一生懸命にやりますから。おい、そうだね。いや。どうか。あんな恥ずかしいものまでして。あんなの。あ、ロ。レイトーク。ま、ジャスト。ファイト。
His father used it then, and then he died. To protect someone precious to him. <laughs> Look at his hair, it's on fire! Protect something precious enough to give your life for. Oh, it's interesting. Like fall. Mm. The climax of youth. <laughs> He opened it. He did. The eight gate. When you first heard about it, you know, way back when uh, Rockley used it and they explained what it was, did you think you would see someone open the eight gate? I didn't think I wouldn't. I didn't really think about it mm. at that time. But I guess it makes sense that they would do it, you know. They don't put something out there you know, in theory, or like tell you a story of something and then not make it happen. Mm -hmm. But also, the description they gave is such a tease too, right? If you open the A gate, you achieve power that's, you know, said to be even greater than the Okage's. So, yeah. like, you would want to see that as a viewer, but yeah, also, you true. know what the... The consequence of that is. Mm -hmm. I think what's very interesting is that when I first heard guy talking like so much about the power of youth and all of that, it's just it seems like just something funny. A goofy you know? thing, like, yeah. yeah, exactly. It's like his goofy <laughs> thing there, but like really, in this episode, it kind of like comes around into something more meaningful. Is know, this really. youth? <laughs> <laughs> no, not that. But like this part here, yeah, you yeah. know, mm -hmm. where like it's not just about yourself and your actual physical youth you know it's about passing down that spirit that fighting spirit mm -hmm. to the the next generation which yeah. is really a theme that's present throughout the whole anime right? and even the words. the analogy at the end right like when mara said it looks like red leaves yeah. it's like yeah red leaves falling to give you know nutriment for future yeah growth so. exactly I guess we'll see you next time uh, yeah. where that leads as we react to more episodes of Naruto Shippuden. If you want to be there for those reactions, we invite you to subscribe to this channel. The button is down below. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you for liking it if you didn't. Have, Have a, a nice, nice day. day.